My name is David Baker, DO. I'm the physician manager at Central Maine Pediatrics. Mindfulness is primarily the connection of the mind and the body being present um, in the same place at the same time. So often today people are, their minds aren't present even though their bodies are present, especially children in school. Their minds can be thinking about what they're going to be doing after school, what they did yesterday, and they're not really in the here and now. Mindfulness allows the participants to enhance their emotional intelligence, especially in children. What that means is allowing children to learn to take control of their emotions rather than letting their emotions take control of them. And so often today, children especially are vulnerable to reacting to situations um, in their environment, in their lives, without taking the time to stop and think about it. Mindfulness is applicable to children of all ages. Even preschool children can practice um, something called mindful breathing. And when children, children can be taught that when they're stressed or anxious to just separate themselves from the situation and then to spend several minutes on focusing on the flow of their breath as it goes in and out of their body. And if they think of the um, in-breath as being a source of relaxation and then exhaling and releasing their angst or anxiety or frustrations they have and practicing that, they become empowered to, again, take control of, of themselves and, and separate themselves from the situation. One of the little teaching techniques or things I teach the kids to remember is a little mnemonic called PEACE. And PEACE stands for um, pausing when they're faced with a stressful situation, being overcome with anxiety from, say, poor performance in a test, a, a sports event, if they can remember this mnemonic and practice it. So again, P stands for pausing or stopping, whatever they're doing. E stands for exhaling, meaning they take a breath in and they exhale it out. Uh, a stands for accepting and allowing the situation to unfold without having to react to it. C stands for choosing their response after they've stopped, um, taken a breath, um, accepted the situation, then consciously choosing how they want to respond to it. And then the E is for engaging, at that point deciding what they're going to do, if anything. And if they can just remember to practice peace when they're stressed, it allows them to become more mindful and take control of themselves and, and uh, overcome the situation.